Some people simply have low vitamin D status due to their geographical location. Others because they can't get out in the sun enough due to work and home life. And those with darker skin simply do not produce as much vitamin D in response to sun exposure. And for some of these populations, I think boron could be extremely effective. It is shown that boron can reduce the adverse consequences of a vitamin D deficiency. And the reason is because boron increases the half-life of vitamin D by suppressing the activity of the enzyme that degrades vitamin D. Therefore, essentially making whatever amount of vitamin D you do have stick around for longer and be more potent. The highest boron foods include nuts, apples, apricots, bananas, beans, carrots, chickpeas, dates, grapes, honey, lentils, olives, onions, oranges, peaches, potatoes, raisins, prunes, walnuts, peanut butter, and even wine. Oh, I forgot about celery, broccoli, and Brazil nuts. Low vitamin D status despite supplementation may indicate another underlying pathology or disease, which I've made a video about before. But if you have low vitamin D or moderate vitamin D, and you're not taking high dose vitamin D supplements, you may benefit from increasing the boron content of your diet. With that being said, if you'd like an individualized approach to your nutrition and lifestyle to optimize your health, energy, and body composition, send me a DM to sign up for coaching.